Welcome What's back up? to our channel. Welcome back to our channel. And uh, you, you know, messed it up again because you started did. out and now <laughs> it's all messed up and out of whack. Yeah. So uh, you're gonna see us Look in these same clothes in a separate video because we just filmed another video. So yes. uh, so we're doing like a back to back <laughs> filming thing today. So if you're wondering, yes. that is why you're gonna see us in the same position, same clothes, and everything in two videos. Yes, but we got our forks ready, and we got our forks because we have. All a various nuggets. amount of different nuggets from Wendy's today. So they came out with their sauced nuggets. They just dropped on June 3rd. None of these are labeled, so... We're going to figure it out as we go. Yes, so there is a barbecue, a spicy barbecue, a garlic parmesan, a spicy garlic parmesan, buffalo, and a ghost pepper. I'm going to say this is garlic parmesan, but I don't know. No, I don't know. That looks like buffalo. I don't think it's buffalo. That's the only thing. Like, there's not like, is it actually like infused into the nugget, or do you have to like dip it into it or something? No, uh, it's probably just because they've been sitting for a while. I don't know. <coughs> okay, so that's the buffalo. That is the buffalo. We need some blue. Oh yeah, did you know they have blue cheese now? Get some raspberry to cool that down. Ooh, those Definitely. are spicy. <laughs> I can't tell if these are the buffalo or the ghost pepper ranch. I didn't know you caught ghost pepper ranch. This is probably what it is because it's pretty Ooh. spicy. It has a little bit of heat to it, a Ooh. little bit. <laughs> I'm not really a big fan of like spicy stuff, so we're just gonna set that one aside. We're, we can't determine if that's the ghost pepper, but I think it's the ghost and pepper. I also don't want to ruin my palate for all the other ones because like when you're real spiced out, it's hard to taste other things. So we're gonna go on to the next one here. Of course, I had to be the first one. <laughs> so this one we got. I think it's the regular garlic parmesan. Ooh. Oh, that one smells good. Mm, mm hmm And this is the regular garlic parmesan. That is good. I didn't think I'd like gar um, garlic parm from Wendy's, but that is good. Better than Wingstop's garlic parm. Mm. And like, that's what they look like. They're just like chicken nuggets. But they're sauce. But they have like, well, it's not really sauce. It's like they're like infused into the breading pretty much. Mm, and it has, like a, it has like a little bit of sauce in there, but like, I don't think they're really supposed to like dip it because there's not enough to really even dip them in the sauce. So I don't know. Okay, so this was the garlic parm. This was the regular garlic. So I'm gonna parm. try the garlic parm with their blue cheese here. So let's try. Yeah, they have blue cheese blue that comes cheese. with it. Well, it's, and it's cans. cans. It's not their branded, but yeah. it's, it's cans. It's good with the ranch, so I assume it'll be good with blue cheese. Hmm. So we've tried the ghost pepper. I swear that's the ghost pepper. I think pepper. that's the ghost pepper. And it has the to garlic. Be. That's pretty spicy. So I still have the spice on my uh, tongue from that. So next, which next, this is barbecue. Is this here. the spicy barbecue or barbecue? That is yet to be determined. That's what it looks like. Look at that. Look at that barbecue on there. Regular barbecue. Mm -hmm. It tastes just like their honey barbecue sauce. That's really good. Mm -hmm. I'm a barbecue guy. I like my barbecue. That's a winner right there. Yeah, that one's pretty good. Mm. All right, let's get the next one open up here. It is pretty interesting. They came out with all these different flavors mm -hmm. for their chicken nuggets. So at least like if you have a preference, you know, you can get these instead of just like their the regular, regular chicken nuggets. Chicken nuggets. So you this know? I assume it's gonna be the spicy barbecue because that was definitely the regular Yeah, because this is definitely another barbecue here. So it's probably gonna be the spicy barbecue. There's not a lot of spice, but it is there. 
Yeah, it's not bad at all. I guess you could do it in blue cheese. Let's see. Let's try it out here. Hmm. Yeah, not a ton of heat on that one. Mm -mm. But, I mean, it's pretty good. You still get the barbecue flavor. You get a little bit of kick, so if you want, God, like... my hair's a mess. No, you're fine. <laughs> get a little bit of kick, a little bit of heat. So if you like heat and you just want something barbecue and not like overly heat. That's enough, yeah. It's just enough, you know. So, yeah, I mean, so far they're all pretty good. So, except for that uh, first one. First I still one was don't like that lemonade, but I'm drinking it. A lot it. of heat. <laughs> That's the lemonade from our last video. I don't really like it, but I'm drinking it. It at least cleanses palate. the palate there, so. Right. Fries do that too. All right, I think this is the last one here. Nope. Oh, there's still two more. Okay. So this is gonna be the spicy garlic parm. Why does everything have to be spicy? Yeah, that's definitely garlic parm. Okay. Not too much heat, but just enough. The garlic parm works with this though. I have ranch. I have the blue cheese here. Yeah, this one's pretty good. The garlic parm works with it. Mm -hmm. So again, if you're looking for, you know, something that has like a little bit kick to it, mm -hmm. and they don't lie when it, when they say it has heat, like it has a little bit of kick to it, you mm -hmm. know. So like it's really not like a disappointing, like heat, you know, that you get from some things that it's like oh like it's hot heat, and then you try it, it's like oh really where, <laughs> like you know. So yeah, that one's not bad. You need to drink something though. Gosh, all this spicy stuff. <laughs> So, so this one's probably going to be the buffalo one. You can already tell from the like the orange on it. I was like, yeah, it should be. So the weird thing about the buffalo. Sorry, I'm like dying. <laughs> <laughs> is that there's a buffalo and a spicy buffalo. Is it buffalo spicy to begin with? I don't know. <laughs> but all this spice, I just can't. That's going to be your new catchphrase. All this spice. All this spice. I'm not a spicy person. I'm not one that likes things to burn as I'm eating it. I like more like flavor. I can't tell which one this is by smelling it. If it's the spicy buffalo or the buffalo. Buffalo. Because it's not spicy. It would have helped if they labeled these. Mm -hmm. But they just kind of threw it in that giant big bag that you've seen. <laughs> with her I know. Like, all of them but are they unlabeled. They didn't just stick them in the giant big bag, okay? They put them all in, like, their own, like, two, per, two containers <laughs> per bag, individual, each with yep. their own silverware, their own... Uh, napkins. I'm and like, then also, they're all going to us. Each like, bag also had, or there was also an extra bag that had all the sauces in it and the fries. And I'm just like, what the heck? Like, so why, extra. Like, why is it like? <laughs> so extra. <laughs> all right, now we're going to the last spicy thing here, which is the last thing. But everything's got to be spicy. If you need that's your the, sinuses cleared that's out. That's the like, theme right of this now. video. I'm telling you, Wendy's is not kidding. When they say spicy, right? they do not mess around. Maybe it's there's more spicy things. Maybe we're just not accustomed to spicy things, but like they're not, they're not joking. Like it's spicy. I'm telling you, like don't, they don't mess around with their spice. Don't smell it so close to your nose. It tickles the inside of your nose. You're not supposed to inhale it.
Okay, I really can't tell which one of those two was the spicy buffalo and which one was the buffalo. Because at this point, know. my palate is just spiced. <laughs> I think this one, it, it would have to be because the other one wasn't really too spicy, the regular buffalo. I feel like this one like has less spice like it has like a little bit of heat like as you eat more of it but but it's not as spicy it's not as, the as spicy it. as the ones before which is really weird so you would i think, think buffalo would buffalo. be i think you would well no because we had the buffalo already it, well, so one of them has to be the spicy the, yeah, one yeah one of them i think this is regular buffalo. i think this is a spicy one <laughs> <laughs> you really should have labeled these my days well, I think this is a spicy one. I don't know, I don't but think like it is. either way, it doesn't have a lot of spice to it. So, no, it doesn't. I I don't think that was the regular. I, I think that was the regular buffalo because it doesn't have a lot of spice. And buffalo, in and of itself, doesn't have a lot of spice and everything nice. So, <laughs> <laughs> right. Okay. Well, anyway, we've had so much spice in this video that like we can't even taste anything anymore. I think but... my palate is dead. <laughs> Like, I don't know. I mean, out it? of all of them, I'd probably say the gar garlic parm, the regular garlic parm. I like parm, both garlic parms. And like, the regular barbecue. I like the regular garlic parm, the regular barbecue, and the spicy version of the garlic parm and the barbecue. If I, I had could to do the buffalo. The buffalo is okay. Yeah, the mm -hmm. buffalo is not bad either. But the ghost pepper, I cannot do. That was, uh, that was that definitely was the first lot. one. And then <clears throat> the... Um, the spicy version of the garlic parm was also good, Yeah, too. That, that one was really If good. I had to pick a spicy one, I'd probably pick mm -hmm. that one, you know? I could do the spicy barbecue, though. It's just, like, literally, we started out with that, like, ghost pepper one or that really hot that was, one or that whatever. That was the mistake. <laughs> and that, like, that's the one that, like, the rest of the video is just like, oh, my gosh, like, my mouth is still burning from that, <laughs> you know? But, um... Gotta just drink this blue cheese real quick. Be right back. <laughs> I don't know, but... I mean, otherwise, it's not bad. I mean, it's. It, I mean, it, they were all good. Yeah. I mean, it's just definitely interesting how they came out with so many different flavors, and how they're also trying to get into spicy, like spicy ones also. So if you like spicy foods, if you really like spice, I definitely suggest coming and trying these. Mm -hmm. You know, get you some spicy nugs and everything, and there but you I go. Just, you and know? you can also so it's in a four pack, a six pack, or four pack, eight pack, or oh 10 yeah, they pack. come in different sizes um, too. So, but I wish that like they made well then. I wish that they made like more regular flavors than just like. The garlic parm and barbecue, though, like I wish that they made like honey mustard, a honey, or, yeah, like a honey like, mustard flavor, or like even just like a dry rub flavor or something, like because they really went, went all out on this spicy Korean stuff. Korean barbecue, like, maybe you know, like a sweet and spicy one, something like that. You know, like they could have went a little bit further with it. Yeah, but I'm not gonna complain because they no. came out with like eight different flavors. They did. They did. <laughs> you know. So despite I'm not going to complain at all. Despite like, most of them being spicy and buffalo-y, but... <laughs> yes. But yeah, I would de definitely say it's a good idea. Um, we did not try the KFC sauce nuggets because they didn't... Ha like, they had flavors still, but not as many as we wanted to try. That's why we went this route instead, because one, the KFC ones have been around for a while, if you're wondering why we didn't try those. And two, these just dropped. So we're like, we got to go get them like right now. <laughs> um, why am I putting my fork at you guys? I'm so sorry. I don't know. You're just like talking with your fork for some reason, but. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why. I'm so sorry. I'm going to, I'm just jabbing you guys. <laughs> um, but like, yeah, I think they did a good job. Like, honestly, like I don't have many complaints and I like the fact that they gave blue cheese as an option mm -hmm. because not a Blue lot of people is good. it is but not a lot of people like ranch especially with their spicy Doing things again, you're jabbing <laughs> especially <laughs> <laughs> it's because i'm holding the fork <laughs> here i'll put it in the other hand and then we like this one <laughs> and this one <laughs> but like none of people not a lot of people like ranch so like blue cheese is a good option 
for the people who don't like ranch, especially with their, you know, spicy flavors, because a lot more people like blue cheese over ranch with that. Mm -hmm. So, like, I, and those are the only two, like, sauce options they give you um, to choose from with these. But obviously, if you're at the window, you can be like, if you're getting the barbecue ones, you'd be like, hey, throw an extra barbecue sauce in there, you know, for extra dipping sauce. That is another thing I will say. Like, even though they're not super saucy in the containers, they have a lot of flavor. Like, oh yeah, you know, like like they like infused it into like the breading, pretty much. So like, really, like that's why I was saying, like, are you supposed to dip it in the little bit of sauce that's in there? Is like, what's the yeah. point of a little bit of sauce when it's not really on them? It's just kind of like infused into them. Yeah. I don't know what the deal with that was, but otherwise they were yeah. good. But yeah, I would definitely recommend trying them. But my favorite would definitely be the garlic parm because I'm a garlic parm girly. <laughs> despite liking spicy stuff some of them were a little much aka the ghost pepper one yes um so kudos to anybody who likes ghost pepper ranch and ghost pepper stuff at wendy's but it, it's just too much my and mouth again, is just i'm now sure we're probably up. just like <laughs> newbies to the whole uh <laughs> we're little babies. spice thing you know a lot of people are probably watching this like oh my gosh it wasn't even that spicy <laughs> And I'm, I'm like, well, hey, I'm not I mean, really a spicy person. The, I don't really go out of my thing, way to eat spicy stuff. The spiciest stuff, so. thing that we eat is uh, hot fries from Andy Caps, but those aren't even spicy. They're not even that bad, yeah. <laughs> like, that is our spice level tolerance. I eat flaming Hot Cheetos every now and then, but like, I usually dip it in like cream cheese or something because it's good because you're weird it's good mm -hmm. cream cheese and hot cheetos is delicious also if you dip it in uh sour cream that's also very good but cream cheese <laughs> is like my number one but like that that's our spice tolerance to give you like a yes. line of how much spice we get wow this the the what is purple something's making my hair look like a purple hue right here i don't know <laughs> but anyway yeah that's pretty much our thoughts on Should the I new wendy's purple? chicken nuggets so mm -hmm. no the answer is no why that's cute like, not look, look full at it. bright cute. purple. It's not. Look, look at the camera. It's not full bright purple. Why am I saying yeah, that? Yeah. What are you asking me for? Blind. I'm colorblind. I can't see that. We went and watched the movie If, and he literally kept telling me that the big purple dude, that I forget his name, uh, Blue. Blue. His name was yes. Blue because he was blue. No, he was telling me Blue was blue, and Blue was not blue, and I kept telling him Blue was purple. He did not believe me. That's confusing in and of itself. Blue was purple. But he That's kept confusing. telling me blue was blue, and I was like, no, he is not. He is purple. <laughs> well, is... I don't know. But, yeah, that's pretty much it for this video, though, because, I mean, yep, they were pretty good. I liked pretty much all of them, I yep. mean, except for, like, the overly yeah, spice factor, you know. It was just, like, a lot. But, it I was. mean, otherwise, the flavor was good on all yeah, of them. Yeah, they were so. there. The flavor was there. Yeah. But, yeah, anyway, guys, let us know down in the comments if you tried any of these. What were your thoughts? And, um, yeah. Yeah. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys. Bye, guys.